Hi everybody, this is Sam with Python Basics, and we are going to jump back to iter tools. And we're going to talk about a method that is very, very, very handy. So, all right, if you're new here, thanks for joining us. And if you've been here a while, you know how we do this A, B, C, D, E, F, G. But if you are new, uh, I recommend you click on the subscribe button and most important the notification bell because we have videos uh, every single day and I don't want you getting behind or feeling overwhelmed and we have a couple different uh, modules going on at one time but alright uh, th what this task is going to be let's say we you had to run across and come up with all the combinations for um, all the letters and you could have groups of three so think about how in the world you'd have to write that algorithm so you'd go all right first one second one index zero one and then go two and then cycle through and then go and move on through so that would be unbelievably that would take a while to come up with that but like I've said before I'm a huge fan and very lazy and I love the tools that Python has for us. And one super important thing if you're new here, if I'm not explicitly talking about a subject, if you see anything here that you do not understand, everything is searchable. We do micro videos here and you can go and search for any of these on, on, the, on this channel. So all right. <clears throat> So let's import and bring this and let's look at help. All right, so what this does is it takes an iterable, R is the length and it returns all of the combinations. So a list of four numbers, three, it wants a list a length of three and here are the combinations. So all right, let's just jump into this. So if we have letters A, B, C, D, E, F, G, I believe that's seven. So all right. Now, and we want to kick out um, three letters at a time and all the combinations thereof. So it's literally this easy. So all right. Where we go and we take, and let's just do X equals, and we're going to put this and we do that letters letter and length of three so this is going to create <clears throat> an object so all right let's call x it's a combination object so all right now it's a, it's a it's an iter iterable um so all right so let's put this in a comprehension list comprehension so I for I in X close this out and then let's just call Y so all right that's a little jumbled so we are going to change this and we're going to use our join and again if anything you're seeing right now that you do not know how to do and I'm not talking about it there's a video for it so all right, now let's look at this and see how nice and neat this becomes. We call Y. <laughs> y. Okay. Boom. Awesome. We don't have to write some crazy algorithm that goes through and indexes and la 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 la. This is a very awesome, awesome tool that is in a built-in function, excuse me, built-in module that Python's already done for us. The creators of Python go through this. So A B ABC, ABD, all the way through, and then it just rotates and moves up and goes every single combination. And we know how to do this. There's 35 different combinations. <coughs> Excuse me. So, all right, there we go. There's combinations from the iter, iter tools module from Python. So, thanks for watching. If this is the type of video you like, please give it a thumbs up. And again, don't forget to click the subscribe button and most important, that notification bell. Now, also, super important, been getting a lot of good comments, questions, video requests. 
I love video requests. Crap. Sorry if that wasn't able to be seen. But that's an alias. Guess what? There's a video. But all right. I digress. Apologize. So I love video requests. Love to do um, ex more in-depth explanation videos have gotten some really good questions. So please don't hesitate to ask any questions. This is your channel. Help me lead the direction that you want to take this and you want to see because I'm doing this for you guys to help you. I want you to have one place to come and find the videos that you need that you can revisit as a resource and have because when I was learning I had to bounce around all over the place put pieces together this and that and just try to figure it out I want you to have one place to come and find absolutely everything so thanks for watching and we'll see you next time bye guys